struggle in like a week, two weeks, maybe. Um, surprise defectors. I, I mean, I can't get uh, purged on this hand, so I think I gotta gotta play defectors here. Um, B war is nice. Um, yeah, I can't get defected here. I can't can't get purged here. <clears throat> Uh, it's against Camille. He's uh, not doing super well in OTSL right now, but he did beat. I don't remember who, he, but he's uh, one in four, I think. So, um, <clears throat> okay. Didn't need to defect that, but <clears throat> at least he doesn't know if I have a scoring, and he probably doesn't have a scoring. I shall deduce. Okay, that's kind of nice for me. I will go ahead and do this. <laughs> yeah, so I haven't played in a while. I'm a little rusty, maybe. I have two more OTSL games coming up this week against the uh, Junji Shu and um, Jesse Marshall. <clears throat> But uh, out of nowhere, Camille emailed me and said, uh, hey, do you want to play this game? And I said, yes. So here we are. Um, <clears throat> Fidel coup. OK, I actually don't mind that. Uh, giving me some easy mill ops. And I would rather put Fidel into the draw pile again and independent reds than the other way around. So. I do want to play CNS before this turns over, though, so... And probably hold Sokka's... Or if I can, hold IP War. Don't lose too much on mill ops if I do that. Okay. Um, I had a two up I wanted to play, but I don't. However, one in France might make sense. Now, now that Suez is gone, and I'm not giving him sock gubs. Putting one in France feels decent. Ugh. Okay. Well, I had to do that in case he had Middle East. I'll do this. Full space sock goes, I think, if I can, and hold. Hold IP War. <laughs> I might coup actually. Coup with CIA. Okay. All right. Let's get rid of that. Um Let's go North Korea. That was a one. I just don't want it to go up to five, and I don't want to 
um, have mill ops to take on AR6. I think he'll probably go into Iran here, or maybe, maybe if he goes into Afghanistan, I don't have a counter to that. Then I'll have to play IP war. Um, into. Indonesia, probably. <clears throat> Maybe that was too quick of a play. I had to lower DEFCON that I can't go into Indonesia or Thailand. I can't go into here, so... I guess I could have put that in Malaysia. Maybe. Hmm. Why wouldn't he put one more in Afghanistan there? Let's do this. I know I could space it, but I feel like it's probably going to take two out of West Germany and one out of UK, right? I'll just put one into West. If he does that, I'll just put one into West Germany. And then. Okay. I have to put it into Thailand. Um, maybe I'll get duck a cover. I have to do this. Let's not get duck a cover. Um, hmm. get those four ops, but not loving the rest of my hand here. Um, I mean, nice to get the stall, but he's going to blockade it away. And I don't have a headline, which is really annoying. Maybe it's just Japan, because if he plays decal and then drops Asia, yeah, it's just Japan. I have to hold NATO. Truman is nice here, though. <clears throat> but this is a whole bunch of one-offs. Very annoying. Um especially if this coup is successful. I can't play NATO here, as you'll know. Um, but if he Because I'm threatening to take Thailand. Oh, that's an annoying purge. And that's why I shouldn't have headlined Japan. Although I, d I didn't have a better headline. I mean, maybe IP war, but... Okay, I have to do that.
Oh, this is a brutal hand to get purged. I'm going to have to space uh, D stall anyway. But I'm going to go for the long term play here. Spreading through Lao and then maybe pushing him to go into Pakistan. UN will go into West Germany and I'll hold NATO. Hold NATO. Okay, I'll take those VPs. Um, Now I'll put it in France. Put it in France, I can actually, no, I can't say if he, uh, if he blockades me, I could just let it go. But I don't think I can actually do that. Hmm. I'll put it in France no matter what, and then I'll play German in here. Maybe he'll try to take India. Maybe he'll be happy with his three VPs. And Europe. Okay. Oh, well, that would have been nice. So now the problem is, oh, but he, he just played Europe. So I think I'd rather hold on to this than do that. That makes sense, right? And then after he clues, I fill West Germany. Maybe I just put all three in there. I think I just put all three in there and then hope he doesn't. I mean, he won't be able to headline Europe anyway, do that. Uh, okay. I mean, I'm glad to see all of these cards. <laughs> uh, but he's going to headline Vietnam, so I can't get rid of Asia right away. Um, oh, and he got five year plan too. Actually, I think. I think defectors makes a lot of sense here. Yeah, because Asia runs into Vietnam, so do that. It's going to be mostly hand management this turn, but uh, I can probably, if he doesn't, with NATO, I can get, um, I can fix Europe uh, and maybe even 
I mean, he knows I have Asia, but. Yeah, I mean, either it's Nasser or Vietnam here, or maybe it's Europe. I mean, it would be amazing if he had land here, but he's not going to have land here. <laughs> So if he coos, I get to drop Asia. Oh, double space would be nice here. <laughs> double space would be very nice here. I mean, I have decent ops, uh, but yeah, double space would be really nice here. Imagine this hand being purged. A little bit annoyed that he has five-year plan now. Not that I have any regions that he wants to drop, but, uh, yeah. <clears throat> hmm. Okay. Um, well, in that case, I guess I'll take Mill Ops and protect Panama. He's going to get those seven anyway. Unless he has Europe. I think he would have headlined Europe, though. If he had Europe, he would have headlined it. Am I that far behind that I have to do this? I mean, it's also two VPs. That's my only coup target. I think I'll take it. Please don't have... Please don't have Europe. Please don't have Europe. Maybe I should have cooed with Korean. I was thinking maybe there's a small chance, tiny chance, that I don't have to play Korean though. Yeah, maybe I should have cooed with Korean more instead, knowing that I, if I get if I get double space, I'll probably space something else rather than Korean. Got BP blind there. <laughs> So now I will deduce <laughs> uh, that he does not have
he does not have um, Europe, uh, but I will take that anyway. Uh, and then I will score Asia, and then I will space decall. And if I get to space a second time, I will space Korean War. Please fail. Please fail. Fuck. At least he doesn't get double space. I'll have to play Korean War. But maybe that's fine. Yeah, that'll be fine. Got Nasser for Mosin, Fight Your Plan, and two mystery cards. Maybe one of them CIA? I have the China card now. Oh, but CIA isn't even a. <laughs> CIA is not a problem for him. So my last plays will be, so I'm scoring Asia and then De Gaulle into France, Korean War into France and Zaire. I think has to be what we do here. Okay. Congratulations on your eight VPs. And he's gonna play Nasser. Oh, Nasser's annoying here. Nasser's super annoying here because I need to go into Libya after he events it. But maybe he wants to hold it till after Sadat. Some, sometimes people like to do that. That's fine. Okay. I won't be flipping Thailand, my friend. You don't have to worry about that. Okay. I think the last play now is going to be Nasser, right? It's got to be Nasser. No, I have Korean War. He does not know that that's my last card. He knows these doll and. But not Korean War. I know Nasser Fighter Plan for Mosin. So if he doesn't play Nasser, I'll go Zayer in France, Korean War. If he does go Nasser, I think I'll go Zayer in Libya. Okay. Okay. Um. The annoying thing is I can't steal the coup from them because there are no good to coup targets from you. So I think I have to do this. But at least I get France out of it because getting a coup target's useless. And that's not a hand I wanted to have here. At least I'll get Melops with Brush War, but this is this is not the kind of hand I need here. Oh. Oh, this is painful. I mean, what's my headline? <laughs> what's my headline? Shuttle? Kitchen debates? Okay. 
Well, at least now I can win if he gets. Uh... Now I can win if he gets um... CIA. That was not the case before. Uh, so that's nice. So I'm assuming now he coups Angola and I go Panama, France, something else with OPEC. Or who knows, maybe he goes France. I still don't have a coup target. <clears throat> this is <laughs> this is looking dire quite early too okay um I think I have to do this. I have to give him these three VPs because I can't. Um, that's three VPs, but it secures Africa, it secures Europe, and it gets me presence in Central. Um, yeah. And it lets me space it makes my hand situation easier. Who knows, maybe I'll even get Nigeria out of it. <clears throat> Just hope he doesn't have uh, South African unrest or Portuguese. And the fun thing is that I have who targeted now and he does not. Oh, he would have to have ABM to get a lots. Basically, I'm telling him that I don't have Sadat doing that, but feels okay still. I mean, that's a brush war target. If he takes Egypt, that's a brush war target for me. So maybe that last stop shouldn't have gone in there. But I felt like I have to play OPEC uh, before he fills up Iran or something else. I need to be the first to space here. Good thing is he doesn't have a whole lot of VPs coming in. I have Europe coming, which is nice. 
uh, in Africa, if it if I can if I can maintain this Africa, which I probably can't, but that'll probably be my hold card. No, again, that has to be my hold card. Damn it! <laughs> Too many red cards. Too many red cards. One in Egypt there is a little bit suspicious. Oh, I don't know. I don't know what I'm talking about. God damn it. <laughs> well, I was going to fail anyway, so, you know. What do I brush for here? Do I brush for Egypt? Do I hold on to brush for? Now it's getting scary. Now it's getting to a point where I actually, I can't let him have Egypt. Um, and then score Middle East. So I think I have to do this. As ugly as it is, I think this is what needs to happen. And then I fail anyway. Fuck. Oh, I guess he was only one VP away, but damn. Um, I think. I think I'm in real trouble here. Don't play and I don't want to play a war. Because I don't want to give him mill ops. I need those two VPs. So I think this, and then you you two incident into Saharan and South Africa. <laughs> This is five year plan Europe. <clears throat> yeah, this is five year plan Europe. I don't hate that. It should actually be that. You can include somewhere, and then I go in to Nigeria. Maybe Nigeria can wait. Okay, gets one, I get two.
often is he going to have a problem hand? <laughs> That's my question. I'm going to, I need to headline South America here. Even with him that he can't, he can't get VPs from it. He can, I guess he could place into Venezuela, coup Brazil, and then get a six and then get presence less. Um, but yeah, it has to be that. As ugly as that is as well. Um, and then the fight will be for Africa. And oh yeah. Uh, and then the fight will be for Africa. Oh, he's gonna have Shay. That's the, you know, the annoying thing about that is that he's gonna have Shay. Ooh. Okay. Okay. I can wait with Sadat until after Muslim Rev. Uh, there's no guarantee of that, but I could try to let that happen. Uh, I could try to steal mill off from him here. Oh, he's got Costa Rica, though. Let's see that check. Did have check. Okay. And he rolls a six and a five. Six and a five. Pretty decent. I roll opposite of what I want to roll. Now I don't have any big cards left. He doesn't know I have a super weak hand, but oh man, really? Oh fucking Christ. That's just awful. Oh, and I played that before I played AI War, so that's good. Maybe the nuclear set plan should have been better, but if 
but after he takes Nigeria, I still don't have a... Oh my god. <laughs> okay. All right, so that goes here. I absolutely cannot play I War. So five-year plan was a huge blunder there. Obviously, I didn't think that far. Um, can I get camp here? That'd be nice. Don't think I'm going to get camp, though. Uh, so I need to space AI War, maybe hold it, and then coup with Ayende and still get them on mill up, which is... I even said he's got Che, right? <laughs> I did do that nonsense. Okay. Um. That's a pretty good hand he had there. That's a pretty good hand with only South America and Africa left to score. Uh, and Europe, I guess. But. <laughs> Quag, Portuguese, let's get rid of Southeast Asia as well. And the problem is, I think that he's going to get Africa next turn. So I'm going to move Africa as well. Yeah, he gets that domination too easy. So, coup here. Can I have Camp David? Let's see how that gives him two VPs. Salt gives him two VPs. Um, space, <clears throat> cultural, and Willy gives him VPs. Olympic Games gives him VPs. There's a lot of shit that gives him VPs here. Uh, there's also stuff that gives me VPs, so that's good. Um, And <laughs> cards that are still left are things like CIA, grain sales, rear guards, VOA, rear trap, lions, ask not. Goodies, goodies like that. Um, I think I have to coup with Sadat here um, because I need that one VP. Okay. Okay. He has five-year plan in hand. So. I could put him in a very awkward situation here with 
purge and grain sales. Um, also very possible that he has Muslim revs and that that's his headline. Uh, or maybe gunman. No, Muslim revs would be his headline if he, he if he has a chance. After I just did that with Sadat, uh, he cannot get three VPs here. So that's good. Uh, if he has CIA here, he needs to space it right now. So I think I'd like to do this. It's going to hurt if he has... I might just play it right away, I guess. A very short hand. <clears throat> okay, can I can I def contract them here? If he has CIA and I purge him here, he loses. Hopefully, yes, yeah. <laughs> uh, and even salt, I can how I learned it down back to two. Uh, he might survive with bear trap, I guess. That him trying to salt for OPEC, maybe. That might be what that is. <clears throat> Another problem. You might have Nixon as well, and give me those two VPs. Okay. I think 
here. And I will missile envy him now, in case he has their trap. Maybe he has salt. And that maybe he has salt and that was really dumb. <laughs> Could be it. That could have been my fatal mistake here. Okay. So now he can't get rid of CIA with that. So now I coof for. No ops. I think. I really hope he has CIA. <laughs> I really hope he has CIA. <clears throat> I feel like him cooing with Lone Gunman there made it feel like he has CIA, right? Fuck, that's four. Fuck, that's four. Oh my god, what fucking idiot I am. That's four VPs. And it lets him play another card. another card and hold CA. What a silly turn that was. Um, what a silly, silly turn that was. This actually lets me get two more VPs here um, by cooing it on battleground. And I think I'm going to coo Lao. Um, okay. <laughs> we play on. Um, okay, so now he actually has. Now he actually has CIA. Um, now 
He actually has CIA. And he has and he has sock guns. That's annoying. Um Colonials is nice. I think Colonials is my headline, right? So he has CIA, BOA, Osuri, Cuban, Missile Crisis Labs, Sock Guns, Cultural Rev, and Willie Brandt. Um, Sock Guns cancels my Europe scoring, so I can't headline that. Um, so, Colonials it is. Annoying thing about one small step here is that I want to get those space VPs. He can't get six VPs here, so that's good. Um, yes, he has OPEC, but um, OPEC is only worth three. Yeah, of course, that suck goes. Oh, this would be a comeback for the ages. Oh, and now he cruised Italy, of course. Uh... Does he coup Italy? Of course he gets a sixth on that. Of course he gets a sixth on that. All right, I will coo. I won't do anything. Maybe. He's going to give me another coup is the thing. So uh, he's going to give me CIA here. He's got to give me CIA here. So um, I think I could Thailand. No, I'm never going to flip Asia Dom anyway. Like, that's just not happening. So, I think a coup Argentina. And I roll a one. He rolls a six, I roll a one. Makes sense. I mean, you have to give me CIA here. You can't, you can't not give me CIA here. Yeah. Thank you. Um.
Why do I get all of the small rolls? I want bigger rolls. I want way bigger rolls. That. Oh, now with OPEC and Cultural and Willie, he wins. Wait, I have to do this. And then get that Muslim space. I mean, he's going to win this game anyway. I'm just trying to survive as long as I can. Um, it was a big mistake by me to let the let that Congo to five there, so he could coup Italy. I should have, so in hindsight here, I should have cooed lower DEFCON um, to three and gotten one DP that way. Uh, I didn't consider stock govs and the fact that Italy would be cooable for him. So that's a blunder on my part. Yeah, I, I, uh, I'm okay with that. I, uh, I'm not okay with it, but I uh, uh, will gladly admit that that was my own fault. <clears throat> uh, we'll get to another hand here, but it is just so <laughs> painful, this game. Uh, this game has been really fucking painful. VOA, Surrey Culture, and Willie are left. Puppets is useless. But after he plays Cultural, uh, I need to play Nixon. Because uh, I need to shorten his hand before the late war. Not for the VP. Okay. So I guess I drop Europe. It's got VOA with Surrey and Cultural. Doing so hot with the rolls today. So either he gives me China card with the Suri or he plays cultural, in which case I can take the China card with Nixon.
So two two ways to think about this. Either he had lines Middle East, and if that's the case, then I have to play Star Wars for VOA. I think Hunt is actually a lot better. It allows a possible flip of Mexico, and I lower DEFCON which is probably my real way of winning. Um, he has green sales and another card. So I think it has to be Junta, and hopefully he doesn't have Middle East. Right? That's annoying. Does he remove Star Wars or ask not? Question? Might not matter. I mean, he probably has war games, so. <clears throat> this has been an interesting game of trying to survive. Uh, I haven't played very well, um, but I have enjoyed playing it. Um, more games? Middle East. Either one. Notice how he rolls sixes on everything. Fun. That's super fun. Um, sure, two point eight percent chance. <laughs> Maybe I should have tossed this old hand to ask not. It's also annoying. I don't really, I guess I should, yeah, I should space quite minor. It's just, yeah, I'll take Cuba. Hopefully I won't get Ortega, but like, I, oh, come on, come on, that's,
from us and removed. Yeah. But that could still be important. I mean, it's not going to be important, but it could theoretically possibly be important. Flipping Thailand only matters if Southeast Asia comes out, then it's four BPs plus two in final for Asia, the so six. Okay, so now I have to flip it. <laughs> And he has a Suri, so maybe he'll give me a China card back. That'd be nice. I would really like that. <laughs> no, that's his base card for sure. Um, Every fucking war. Every fucking war. Game is getting a little bit silly, and one of those should absolutely. Have gone. To Thailand. What am I thinking? One should have been over technically Thailand. And one should have been Cuba and then UN and then Cuba. Uh, can we talk about this hand that he just had? Like, even my event is good for him. That's nice of him to give me North Sea Oil after he double uh, shortens my hand. That's super nice of him to do that for me. Oh, mill ops too. Mill ops are a thing. Okay. Right, cool. Something like this. Okay, all right. Uh, 
and humans with all kinds of cards here, but Teardown is pretty good. Teardown and then Grand Cells. That's funny, he gets decalled after I get Southeast Asia there. That's hilarious. Um, do I get mill ops from this? Do not get mill ops from this. I rolled two on my coups. Like the hipster I am. All right, that was a terrible game by me. Um, I'm not happy with that, how I played. Uh, but I also want to point out he got much better rolls than I did. <laughs> and some of these hands were just like, I mean, Um, I mean, these hands are just, uh, his wars won and my wars lost, uh, it's a big factor here. Um, two big mistakes. One was playing flower power before AI war. It actually became awkward for me with AI war there and then letting Italy get to five, I I think I stand by my trying to get him to CIA thing. Uh, but, uh, um, yeah, thanks for watching. <laughs>